get my life together, okay? You hear that? That's glass, sis. This means it's durable, okay? All you gotta do is say yes. Like, this is not a diet meal because I use so much butter on these damn potatoes. Mmm. Hello, my loves, and welcome back to another video. Today is December 1st. You won't be seeing this video on December 1st, but today is December 1st, which is why I am doing a monthly reset. I need to get my life together okay we wrapping up quarter four before i head into the new year i need to be set straight okay so i know y'all see a ton of stuff behind me so let me tell y'all the plans for today because i know y'all see a ton of stuff behind me it's probably distracting but we're gonna get into unboxing a couple of things that i got from the black friday sales i usually never shop on black friday or cyber monday but i did this year and i got some kitchen gadgets so i need to do an unboxing and show you guys all of the goodies that i got from the sales i need to wash some things because i got a lot of kitchen stuff that we're gonna use later after i go grocery shopping i'm gonna do a trader joe's haul because girl I haven't gone grocery shopping ever since I've been back from my trip. And I got back from Costa Rica November 21st and it's December 1st. That's crazy. So we need to go grocery shopping and we need to only get healthy items. I'm going to try not to go to regular grocery stores anymore, y'all. Because uh, I just need all the organic healthy shit. Okay. And then I'm going to come back. We are going to organize my refrigerator and hopefully i just feel at peace after i do all of that okay so let's jump right into opening all these goodies i had to pick up a kettle okay i'm gonna link everything that i got from amazon in the description box below make sure you shop my amazon storefront i'm probably gonna create like um a kitchen gadget type thing so yeah and the crazy thing is i wanted to film a TikTok. So I'm probably going to put all this shit back in the box and film a separate video for that. Which is absolutely bonkers. But let me show y'all first. So this is the Kosori um, wireless kettle. I'm excited because if you know me, I love teas. I, can, I drink tea every morning when I have some. Right now, I don't got no damn honey, so I haven't been drinking my teas. Like, ugh, that's why I need to go to the grocery store. But, basically, I wanted this kettle because I'm tired of putting, I'm tired of boiling my water on the stove for my tea. That's ghetto. And y'all know I like to film, like, aesthetically pleasing, um, you know, like, coffee and, like, drinks and stuff. I can't be boiling my water on a stove that's ghetto. So, this one comes with, like, preset buttons for your like water temperatures like you can set it to boil you can set it to coffee green tea white something i don't know you can hold the temperature for an hour now if you are like me one of your um uh, what's it called one of your love languages is acts of service and when my man over here oops when my man over here and i make something for myself and i wake up before him like i want to make sure that if i make him some tea the water is still going to be held at the same temperature that mine was for him. You can't tell me that's not cute. Like, that's so convenient. The way they be boxing this stuff, it's like, they don't even want the person that bought it to get it out. But it's the perfect size. Because, like, how much water do you need to be boiling at once? Let's be real. So, basically, this is the base. Cute. And then you just sit the tea kettle on it. <sighs> like so like that how cute and then here's the top how precious how stinking precious how stinking precious this is so cute now you know the fuck what I thought this was wireless
Why the hell is Hawaii right there? I don't even really care. So I'm at my little cup. Get ready to see all of the videos. If you don't follow me on TikTok already, I don't know what you're doing. And please follow me on Instagram. I think I said this in one of my other videos. I don't understand how I got almost 50K on YouTube, 40K on TikTok, and I got 2K on Instagram, which is not enough. So, in relation to the tea kettle, I also picked up some glass aesthetically pleasing looking ass mugs, and I'm so excited. I ain't gonna cap to y'all already open these because I was too geek. I was too geek. Like, perfect. The perfect size. It's nice and thick. Um, you can tell it was like double glassed. You can tell right here. So cute. Perfect size. I cannot wait. I don't have, I didn't have any mugs besides the one that I stole from my grandmother's house. Because <laughs> it was her favorite mug. It was one of the mugs that she used a lot. So I wanted to take it to remember her. But so I was thinking cute. I got a set of two. And be careful because they was advertising another size to me. And the size was small as hell. But these are 400 mLs. And they're perfect. So um, I can't wait to wash everything in the dishwasher. And then I can put it away. And I also wanted mugs that match the rest of my glassware. So let me show y'all. As you can tell, glassware, right? It's going to match perfectly with the aesthetics. Yes. Like, I didn't want no colorful mugs. Or I didn't want no mug that had a saying on it. I just want the vibes. Okay? We're going to keep it going with the glassware, okay? So let me turn y'all back this way. So next up, I don't even understand how I was functioning in this apartment for a year. I've been here a year, y'all. Yes, I just hit my year anniversary without actual tableware so i boiled out when i got glass to wear at that because i don't deserve anything less than that and i'm excited because when i go grocery shopping i'm gonna get my fruits and my vegetables and i'm gonna clean them and i'm gonna store them so they last longer because my fruits and veggies be going bad real fast like no ma'am so they come in different sizes but you hear that? That's glass, sis. This means it's durable, okay? So this one is like a circular one. Obviously. This one is square. It says it comes with a year warranty card. That's cool, because y'all know shit be breaking. It's two in here. They come in all section sizes, alright? So, the only thing that these don't come with is like... The ones that separate your food. But it's okay. Because I'm, I'm still in love with these. And they suction. So I can tell like my food is really going to last long in here. And that's exactly what we need. Because that's something I struggle with. In terms of living by myself. I don't always eat all my food at once. And I hate when stuff go bad before I had an opportunity to like really indulge and eat in it. I mean, to indulge in it and eat it all. Alright. Now. Things TikTok made me buy. These motherfucking noodles. And I regret it. Because you can see. Because you can see the pink bag was open because I ate something last night. When I tell you, them motherfuckers are spicy. I didn't put two and two together that this brand is the same brand that made the like two times spicy noodles when like everybody was doing a noodle challenge on youtube and shit y'all i'm not full on fire last night oh i'm gonna keep them though and i'm just gonna put less of the liquid sauce in there because i taste so good and i like the the texture of the noodles like in terms of texture these are my favorite noodles but in terms of spice baby i was struggling okay this is something i'm really I got me a spice rack, okay? Not only is this a regular spice rack, but this spice rack came with like, uh, I don't know if it's a two year or five year refill, baby. You get 
spices refilled for a certain amount of years like literally they will send you the spices in the mail to refill your jars yes like if you want an aesthetically pleasing spice rack and they also send you the spices and then they also send you refills this is the one to get it will be linked in my description box below okay they give you like the fancy shit like fennel seed chives basil coriander seasonal salt like all like a shit all like a shit so some of the things I'm not going to use, not going to cap to you, and I'm going to switch them out. Um, I'm not going to throw them away. I'm just going to switch them out for things I use a lot, like onion powder, garlic powder, slappy mama, stuff like that. For example, this one is sea salt. It's already labeled. It's already filled. Love that for me. The only thing I don't like is, as you can tell, these are like chunks that would be in like a grinder and this doesn't come with a grinder but that's fine if i want to really like grind some shit up i'll probably get the little bowl with the crusher thing and like make my own spice mixtures or whatever and i wanted my seasonings to be on display it spins i think this is so cool so cute and um i'm gonna put it in this corner right here because it's gonna be really close to me as I'm cooking and chefing it up. excite you but anyways i got a meeting real quick y'all so i'm gonna go handle that and then i'm going to come back when i'm on my way to the grocery store when we go to trader joe's okay okay you guys so i am back from the store i never record in trader joe's anymore because it's always hectic in there and i will beat a, a middle-aged white woman if i have to okay because they really be doing too much in that store but anyways as you can see i got all my groceries behind me so i got some hamburger because i want to make some tacos soon or some nachos and my favorite kind of tacos be either chicken or beef or shrimp i'm really fat it don't matter these right here kombuchas have been saving my life they are probiotics and i drink them every single day they are amazing this is my favorite sauce to get the sweet chili sauce if you like duck sauce baby this right here I'm gonna save your life especially if you pair it with you know their little meals that be in the frozen section i got some honey of course because i'm gonna drink a lot of tea i got some eggs chips i'm upset because i bought these chips because i wanted to try their spinach dip but i'm gonna try to make my own because i got onion garlic spinach i got half a half you know maybe i can make my own put it in the oven i don't know anyways <laughs> like i said i got the spinach some tomatoes some lemons an onion some potatoes that i might be cooking tonight or tomorrow some berries i'm gonna pair this with my oatmeal and i'm also gonna be pairing it with yogurt to make a parfait i got some tea i love tea as you can tell this is like my tea drawer love tea um, and then as far as the little meals that I got, I'm going to try the shrimp. These are like shrimp pop stickers. I'm going to try these. I'm going to try their chicken fried rice for the first time. I'm going to try their honey walnut shrimp for the first time. If you go to Panda Express and you like this, you should try it. I mean, I've never had it before, but it's basically the same thing. But I hate walnuts. So I'm going to stick them to the side. I'm going to try their pork and ginger dumplings, their soup dumplings. I love 
these chicken spring rolls. These are like the best egg rolls ever from like a grocery store. I want to try their, um, this is ricotta spinach field raviolis. I got some veggies. This is just a, a mixture of green vegetables. We got broccoli and green beans and zucchini. You know, shit like that. Also, I got some chicken broth because I put chicken broth on a lot of things to cook. This freaking Parmesan cheese right here, y'all, was like $6. Girl, if you don't get <laughs> I got me some pizza. This is like pepperoni and peppers. I got some sour cream. I'm going to try out this yogurt for the first time. Let us free. I like it. Um, it's vanilla flavor, so hopefully it's good. Half and half. And then I got some orange peach mango juice that I hope will taste really, really good. And I didn't tell y'all about this yet. But I also ordered from Amazon some collagen peptides. I have been taking this every day, like, mixing it with juice. Um, because I'm trying to get my skin, hair, and nails together. Okay, so the skin don't look too bad if I do say so myself. If you watched my um maintenance vlog that i just put up i had a pump a pimple here a pimple there and it's literally been like two days since i filmed that video and my skin is already improving my nails from my trip have grown out so much y'all see all that new growth ew they're not lifting so they're not oh my nails are just growing like nothing has lifted on my nails they're just grown out meaning <laughs> This collagen peptide might be working because my nails weren't growing for shit at first. And I can't tell what my hair has been doing. She feels thick, honestly, though. I got a claw clip up here. Oh, I took the claw clip out. Oh, that's why I look weird. <clears throat> Anyways. So I'm just now realizing that I loaded everything up in my dishwasher in terms of all of the, uh, you know, the little glass containers that I bought from Amazon and I put them in a dishwasher and I never turned the dishwasher on. So, I'm probably about to put one of these pieces in an oven grill, take my collagen peptides, let the washing machine actually run, and I'm going to put most of the groceries away and hopefully by the time I'm done, then I'll be able to like store my fruit in the containers once they have been cleaned. very much so later I didn't shower change it to my jammies and I just finished cooking dinner y'all got this little ass plate of food like that's really crazy I'm trying to cut I really don't even know what I'm talking about y'all but I guess I'm trying to cut and I'm trying to eat less I think I spent a lot of time bulking and going crazy with the weights and I don't want to get slim I want to get slim in my upper body. Y'all sure the fuck do. Actually, factually. So let me <laughs> go back a little bit. So I'm trying to cut down how much I eat. And when I went to Costa Rica, I realized American portions, like we don't portion control at all. And it's terrible. Like shit is black as hell. But here's my food. I, I did not. I am not even going to sit here. And um take a picture of this because this meal just looks sad <laughs> mm, it tastes so good though like these are not in no way shape or form like this is not a diet meal because i use so much better on these damn potatoes oh like it's crazy mm, they're so buttery and seasoned so well and crispy because i put them under the broiler 
But yeah, y'all saw what I did. Real quick, easy meal. I ain't nothing to it. I ain't even gonna sit and explain it. I'm about to eat this meal with my kombucha. Okay. Um, I don't know if I showed y'all, but I put away all my veggies. Like, hold on. I got some energy and I went ahead and cleaned my fruit and I separated everything in its own little container and I put a napkin at the bottom so it can absorb some of that moisture girl so hopefully that makes my fruit last longer but I'm gonna go ahead and chill let me give y'all a review on these veggies real quick they're busting they're busting I only add a little bit of butter because <laughs> I wanted them to be nice and soft some lemon juice some lemon pepper some salt and I think that's it and that rest of the butter mixture that I use on my potatoes, I put it on my chicken because I just didn't want it to like go to waste. And yeah, my chicken is to die for. It's so juicy and tender. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. The content I have coming up for you guys is going to be heavily hair based. Okay, I'm going to get into some natural hair and some protective styles. I'm super duper excited for that. So make sure you stay tuned. Turn on your push notifications. And if you always want to see what I got coming up, follow me on Instagram at lifeup underscore together. Okay, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, mamas. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh.